again, Mel Byron here in my beloved Highgate Woods. We might get interrupted by some dogs. Uh, we did a lot in the last video, but that's quite nice. It's a bit of local colour. I'll tell you a story. Um, I used to work for a manager who was so totally risk averse. I mean, it was almost pathological. I can't say the name of the company, obviously. So what I'll do is I'll replace it with a kind of innocuous word, wouldn't we? Swindon. Let's call it Swindon. So whenever you did something that he didn't like or didn't think was the right way to do things, he would just say, you can't do that. It's not the Swindon way. What? Why is the Swindon way the only way to do things? And hey, why not try something else? But he was terrified. He was absolutely terrified. And what he was terrified of uh, was failure. Not me failing, but me failing him and him looking daft. And, and you know, I was, I was terrified as well. So I'll be honest with you, I spent a lot of time trying to tailor what I was doing to fit in with the Swindon way without fully understanding what that way was. And, and obviously, I failed, I did fail, I, I got it wrong because I wasn't being true to what I wanted to do. Sometimes we're going to fail. It actually, ooh, well, it does, of course it matters sometimes, but overall it doesn't matter that much because it's only by failing that we're going to learn how to do things better. I mean, Thomas Edison, who had goodness, goodness knows how many patents to his name, what did he say? Um, I've never failed. All I've done is find 10,000 ways that didn't work. And actually, yes, they might not work for that particular project or that thing that you're doing, but it, it, nothing is wasted. So that didn't work that time. It failed that time. Put it aside, you might find it might be useful at some other stage. Um, the Swindon way, there are many different ways to do things, to do the same thing and come to the same conclusion. Some are better than others, some are more suitable than others, some cost less than others, and we know companies like that, don't they? So don't be bound by what you think you ought to be doing. Um, you know, in terms of positive, positivity and change, try something different. Encourage your managers to try something different. Encourage the people that you manage and that you lead to do something different. And yes, it might not work, but you never know what might come out of it. So forget about the Swindon way. It really doesn't matter. There are many different roads to Swindon. That's all I'll say. So thanks very much from me, Mel Byron, leadership trainer. Um, keep watching the videos, subscribe to the channel, send me some comments, follow me on social media, Mel Byron, you can find me all over the place. And come and see one of my gigs sometime because I'm also a comedian. But mainly what I'm here for today is to try and help you uh, have a better working life, enjoy your working life better. So that's it from me for today from Highgate Woods and I'll be back with you soon. Have a good working week.